morning guys so it's currently 7 a.m. on my first full day in Disney and like I said in my last video today I'm gonna to be doing Hollywood Studios problem is the park doesn't open until 9 so I've got about two hours to kill yet so quick service at my hotel is only just open for breakfast so I'm gonna head over there now and get breakfast and then I'll come back and try out my room I'll probably get started on editing what have been my last video but for yesterday's for me and then I'll head over to the park so I will catch up with you guys probably when I'm getting ready to head over the bus hi guys so I got back from breakfast about 20 minutes ago I started editing yesterday's footage but I've only got the first minute or so of it but I'm gonna work on it throughout the next two weeks because it's not gonna go up probably until I'm back anyway but yeah I'm just finishing off putting everything in my park bag and then I'm gonna head over to the bus stop by the way, I've got my glasses on now, but I am, I'm not going to wear them today. I'm probably going to be in my sunglasses. So yeah, I've got to learn to look at the actual camera and not at the, at the screen. It's not so bad when I'm doing sit downs, but yeah. So yeah, like I said, I'm going to head over to the bus stop and get on the bus to Hollywood Studios because I have a fast pass for Toy Story Mania when I get there. So yeah, I will see you guys over at the bus stop. So I'm heading over to the bus stop now. So the bus stop is just over there. Over there. And but there's my building. I'm on the other side of that building. Yeah, I'm on the other side of that building, but yeah, so only a couple of minute walk, which is quite nice. And yeah, let's go wait on the bus over to Hollywood Studios. Probably not going to film over there, like I'm going to film in the park, but I'm not going to film at the bus just because there's going to be other people there. But yeah, here we go. Hi guys, so I'm at Hollywood Studios now. I was going to film the bus approaching, but it literally pulled up just as I was getting to the bus stop, which is the second day in a row that's happened to me, so I hope that's what pays us for most of the holiday. But yeah, I'm walking down from the bus stop now to the entranceway and then I'm probably going to head to Toy Story Land. I've got about 20 minutes till my bath pass starts for Midway Mania. But yeah, I'm going to head through. I'm going to find a water fountain because I want to top up my water bottle before I go on any of the rides. And I'm kind of thirsty because I burnt my tank on my coffee this morning. Not that you need to know that. So yeah, I'm looking forward to today. This is, I wouldn't say it's my favourite park, but it's like I said, it's got my favourite ride, which is over there now, which I can actually see, which makes me really happy. And yeah, I'm going to try and talk as much as I can over the music. I don't know how much that's going to have, but yeah. So here we go. Toy Story Land and this will be the first time I've actually seen it because it was under construction last year when actually I think it opened like a month later so yeah so this is going to be my first time in the new Toy Story Land and I can't wait it looks pretty similar to the one in Paris which I did a couple of years ago but yeah let's go shrink down to the size of toys for Toy Story Mania. I got about five minutes to start, but less an hour. So I'm gonna go on the swirling saucers just because I've only got a 20 minute wait at the moment. So I'll do that and then go straight over to Toy Story Mania. really 
button. It was better than I was expecting. And I'm glad that I've got a fast pass for it later in the trip. And if I can, I'll try and go on it again later on. But I think the queues are going to start to get longer. But yeah, so I was definitely worth, worth doing first. And I'm glad I did. And it didn't take that long. Well, it did take 25 minutes, but that included dry time. So I'm going to head over to Midway Mania now as my fast pass has started. I'm not going to film myself on the rise, but I will do like a point of view thing. I probably won't film on Midway Mania. I might film the start and the end because I want to concentrate and get a high school. So yeah, I will see you guys towards the end of the ride. <laughs> So I got this in vehicle and it was shocking so I didn't think that was that high school but I'm not complaining. I'm gonna leave Toy Story Land now just because I've done two of the three rides and there's no way I'm queuing for Slinky Dog. I've got a fast pass for it later in the holiday anyway. So I'll do that again. And now, I don't know, I'm gonna wander around for a bit now just because um, I got a fast pass for Terror Terror but it's not from 12 o'clock and it's only just gone 10. So yeah, I'm gonna wander around, maybe go look in the shop, maybe find some credit pennies and I will catch up with you guys in a little bit. So just check the schedule now and the Star Wars show was the first one of the day is going to be starting in a couple of minutes so I'm not going to film that because there's a lot of copyright music in it. So I'm going to stick around and watch that and then I will check in with you guys over an hour into my fast pass but there is a 45 minute wait at the moment so I might go on it but first I think I'll do rock and roll coaster just get out of the way like I said it's my least favourite ride in all the parks but I'll still do it and I've got time to kill so why not so yeah here we go just got done with the rock and roller coaster. Uh, my headache isn't as bad as it normally is, but I do have one. And that's it for the day, I'm not going on that again. And I don't know whether I go on again this holiday, but my headache's not as bad as it usually is, but my date was seen double a little bit towards the end of my eyes focus again. I've still got half an hour to my class pass, so I'm just going to go hang out in the shade for a little bit. And then I'll head to Tara Terra and do that because let's face it, I might as well go for my worst ride to my favourite. So I just got done train time looking at the shops, plus enjoying the air conditioning and just start your warm. My fast pass is due to start in a couple of minutes for Tara Terra, so I'm heading back in that direction now. After that, I'm slightly a little hungry as well, so I'm probably going to grab some sweet. But yeah, I'm going to turn you guys off now and I'll see you. Probably after I've had some, after I've gone on the ride and I've had some tweet. So I had planned to go to Tower Terror and use my fast pass, but it's currently experiencing technical difficulties. So I'm going to go grab some food first. I'm going to use one of my snack credits as opposed to one of the meal credits because I'm not all that hungry. But yeah, I'm going to go. Oh, maybe get a meat pretzel or something or a churro, take whatever I buy first and find some way just to cool off wait out either till my next class pass starts or until Terra Terra comes back on. So yeah, probably not going to film that because mm, there's not any interest in me just sat there eating any food. So I will catch up with you guys when I can. Oh, 
So finally managed to go on Tara Terra. Slightly regretted having the Mickey Pretzel just before. But yeah, still my favourite ride, still loved it. And as soon as I got off, wanted to get back on, but didn't want to wait 70 minutes to do so. I'm now heading over to Star Tours because that's my last fast part that I've booked already. And then probably gonna head back to the resort just for a little bit, just chill out for a bit. And then I'll come back later on and do some more fast passes. So yeah, I will see you guys uh, when I get off to start. Well, everything looks wonderful. That last oil bath really did the trick quite well. Positively radiant. Don't you agree? Yeah. any more fast passes today. I, well, I've got one for Phantasmic this evening, but yeah, as it's starting to get quite warm now and I've done all the rides I wanted to get done today, like I said, I'm going to head back to the resort. I'm going to pick up my resort mug and grab a nice cold drink, hang out in my room for a bit and actually take a look around the resort. I've seen the pools in my building, but I haven't seen the main one, the one that has like the Aztec thing. So I'm going to go take a little walk around the resort and obviously I'll take you guys with me. So yeah, I will see you when I get back to the hotel. Hi guys, so I made it back to the resort. Didn't take that long actually, but I had to wait a little while and it didn't help that there was a little bit of drama when I left one of the studios where another guest actually had a seizure and collapsed. But you know, she's as far as I'm aware she's fine, she was with first aiders and obviously medics are coming and there was nothing I used to ground I could do. And then I'm gonna take a walk around the lake because I haven't seen the other side of the resort yet. And there's some pretty cool stuff over there. There's also an arcade over there I think and I wanna get some quarters because I barely did any press pennies in Hollywood Studios because I had no coins. I had a couple of pennies but like no quarters, which isn't helpful and then there were a lot of machines where they were quarters only. And I wanted to and once again didn't have quarters. And the only change machine I found wouldn't accept any of my notes for some reason, so I'm guessing it was out of order. But yeah, so heading to the quick service now. Shouldn't take me long. I wish I could walk across the bridge, but it's all closed off because it looks like they're doing something over there. But yeah, I'm gonna grab a nice cold drink and take a walk around the lake. So just finishing up my walk around the lake. I've just been to the dig site pool, which looks like Aztec ruins. It's pretty cool actually, and it doesn't look too busy in there. So I might consider that for later in the trip, because I probably by next week or the end of this week, I'll probably be spending time at the pool. But yeah, I've done most of it. I've done like the three quarters of the way around. Now I've just got to go. My room's over there somewhere. I just gotta walk around the rest of the lake but I'm quite happy because there's a quick service day where I can actually refill this mug and it's don't think it's as far to walk as the main building so that's something I can consider this evening if I want to get a drink I'm assuming it'll still be open I'm assuming it's 24 hours but yeah so yeah I'm really loving this resort I didn't know what to think because it is more expensive than when I stayed in last year but so far it's definitely been worth it it's like it's just insane this resort is just amazing and I don't think I'd want to go to the deluxe like this is only a moderate I say only but yeah I'm I'm quite happy with it it's got everything I need it's got a kind of you kind of forget that you're in Disney World or at least I do so yeah I'm probably not going to do anything now until I go back to the parks a bit later on I'm going to enjoy my drink and just chat out my room, just get out of the sun for a bit because I've already think I've managed to catch some of the sun, mainly on my feet. I don't know how I do it, but I do, but yeah. So I'll catch up with you guys when I get back to Hollywood Studios in a little while. Hi guys, so I've had a little chill out in the room and I've had a change of outfit mainly because my shoes are starting to bug me a bit as well and I've been in those clothes for a couple of hours and they're a bit sweaty. So 
yeah, I'm heading back to the bus stop. My plan now is, I am going to go with Hollywood Studios eventually, but I'm going to go to Epcot first, then capture the World Showcase, and then walk along the boardwalk, and then over to Hollywood Studios, just because I want to get something in Epcot, and it's, I think Epcot's going to be the best place to get where I need to get, so. I'll see you guys when I get to Epcot, or maybe a little later on. Your finger right there. I've made it to Epcot now. I'm been through the train stars and everything. Well, they're not train stars, but you know what I mean. I'm gonna head over to Mouse Gear just because I've still got thirty dollars that gift card to use, and I think that'll be a good place to use it. And then I'm gonna hand over to the land because. The reason I come to Epcot is because in the land, or there was last year, there's a change machine where I get quarters and pennies to do my press pennies. So I'm going to do that. Once I've done both those things, I'll then head over to International Gateway to go along the boardwalk. Just came out of uh, Mount Gear. I walked through, I don't know where I walked through, but a nice air conditioned area. Uh, there's nothing I could find in there. I did see something over in Hollywood Studios, so I'm just gonna go back and buy that when I get there now. I'm now heading up to land. I stopped off at Club Cool. I did try the Beverly, but we'll t I'll talk about that in my Epcot video, which is in a couple of days. I'm not gonna really film anything now in Epcot because I'm coming back in a couple of days anyway, so I'll film around here then. Yeah, I'm gonna head over to land, hopefully get some change to do my press pennies. And then I will see you guys when I get to the boardwalk. So I've just come from the boardwalk. I'm now, I managed to get a couple of pressed pennies there, but it was more of the machine one opposed to when you actually put the coins in. I'm now going along the walkway and heading to Hollywood Studios. The app says it should take me about 20 minutes, but I don't think that's true. I can see Hollywood Studios, so I don't think it's gonna take me that long. How will I open it anyway? Yeah. I'm not going to film myself walking there because, let's face it, that's not that interesting. I wouldn't watch it, so I'm not going to film it. But yeah, just enjoy the nice, calm, quiet walk in the lovely sunshine. And I'll check in with you guys again once I'm in Hollywood Studios. How are you? Hi, I'm good. How are you? Good. Thank you. See, I made it to Hollywood Studios. I popped in the stores just as you come in to pick up another magic band. There's one that's blue with like stitch on it. And like I've said before, he's my favorite character. So I wanted to pick that up and I hadn't seen it anywhere else. So I thought I'd get that. Plus I still had the $30 to spend. So I might as well use it on that because there's nothing else I want. I'm now heading over to Muppets because I've managed to get some quarters now, so I want to go over there and get the press quarters. I'm then going to head back towards Tower of Terror because I've mobile ordered for one of the restaurants over there. I'm going to go pick that up, have my food, and then just hang around in that area then until Fantasmic later on, which should be in about two hours, well, two and a half hours if I get in, but if I can get in uh, on another ride, I will. But yeah, so I will probably catch up with you guys later on. So as you can see, I've had my food now. I'm now heading back over to Toy Story Land because uh, Midway Mania has only got about 45 minute wait on it. And I want to see if I can beat my score from this morning. But yeah, after that, I'm just going to head back over to see Fantasmic. And then I'm going to call her a day. So this is probably going to be the last clip for today because I don't want to film on the ride again. Well, I might, if I beat my score, then I'll film it, but yeah. But yeah, I, like I said, this is gonna be the last clip. And I will see you guys tomorrow in Magic Kingdom. Bye.